CNN FM, the financial network. And also ID systems. It gained seven sixteenths after going public at seven dollars. ID makes wireless monitoring and tracking systems. Clients include the U.S. Postal Service, FedEx, and Avis Rent a Car. For more on ID systems, I'm joined by the company's president, Ken Ehrman. Welcome. Were you disappointed, or was today uh, good from your standpoint since you closed in the plus column? Right, we were very excited about how today came out. We believe that the resources we're getting from this public offering will do great things for ID Systems to expand our marketing and really move this company to the next level. And when was the company founded and where and what's? It was founded in 1993 out in Silicon Valley by two Stanford graduates and a chairman and vice chairman of a public battery company, really to explore this concept of tracking and monitoring, but from a different perspective. So explain what it is you do. I mean, I see that you have some boxes here that have your name on it. Right. What we do is we have a miniature computer that is attached to assets like cars, industrial trucks, or even inserted into the mail. And like to, that, like, like an envelope that has... Right. If, that, if you can see that, this device, the U.S. Postal Service inserts it into an envelope, drops it into the mail stream, and then they have readers that are installed at the inbound docks, outbound docks, really throughout their facilities. And by wireless communication, this letter, as it's processed, can now communicate so the Postal Service can see how they're processing mail really for the first time in their history. Uh -huh. And this is the tracking system, is that right? Well, this goes on a forklift, an uh -huh. industrial vehicle, to control access to the equipment by swiping a magnetic stripe yeah, card. But perhaps the most exciting product is this one, although it looks <laughs> yeah, It looks plain. like a black box. It's actually hidden inside of a rental car to automate the rental process for really you and Here, me when me we rent the, the car. So it's hidden inside the rental car. Right, and it's linked to the fuel level and odometer reading. And as you return your car, that information is transferred by radio frequency to the computer system. So a receipt can be generated and handed to you before you even get out of the car. Oh, that's very interesting. And plus you keep track of where the car is and uh, Right. Uh, it doesn't get lost, right? Definitely. I mean, it automates all of their processes, including the rental process. So instead of having that rental agreement in the car and the car sitting, sitting idle for three or four hours until you show up, they can now just hand you that agreement as you leave, really automating the process from their perspective as well as the customers. This is really like the easy pass we have in New York, right, and that you put up on your, uh, on your car. It's the same system, isn't same it? Same concept, but the real difference, the fundamental difference, mm -hmm. is that we have a miniature computer, and it's linked to the asset. So it's reading things like the fuel level, the odometer, or controlling access to the ignition by using that computational power. And that means you can have more benefits for the customer. It's not just an ID number uh -huh. like you have when you're going through the toll booth. Right. It's so much more. Now, you have competitors? We do have a lot of competitors, Motorola, Texas Instruments, AT&T, Raytheon. These are big companies. You're a small company. That's a problem, isn't it? Well, they all have different approaches. We're the only company with this miniature computer device. And by that said, what we have is really a unique, to solution, unique solution to many of these customers like Avis, FedEx, and the Postal Service's problems that these other companies can't provide. Now, with the proceeds of the IPO, what do you plan to do? We are going to really start aggressively selling and marketing this product. That's really the goal of the, the proceeds, as well as to miniaturize the product so that we can expand into even new marketplaces on top of the ones that we're currently targeting. Thanks for joining us, Ken Ehrman of uh, ID Systems, uh, an IPO from today. Thank you.